Returns. <laughs> they Here have. We go. Starting? Yeah. All right. When Venus returns, it comes through the, the blood, deoxygenated blood, comes through the superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava, and it enters the right atrium. And right here, this little thing is called the fossa ovalis, and it used to be called the foramen ovale. And this was what held the two atriums together in the babies. And now, when the blood is in the right atrium, it goes to the tricuspid valve, and it, these are called the chordae tendinae, and this is the papillary muscles, and this right here is the trabeculi, and inside this little dip is the moderator band. Mm -hmm. This is the interventricular septum. Mm -hmm. All right, so after the blood comes from the right ventricle, it basically goes through the pulmonary semilunar valve into the pulmonary trunk, and then that goes to the right and left pulmonary arteries, mm -hmm. and the arteries then go to the lungs where it gets deoxygenated, I mean where it gets oxygenated, mm -hmm. and then it comes back through the right and the left pulmonary veins and it enters the left atrium. And from the left atrium, it goes through the bicuspid or mitral valve. And again, it's the chordae tendinae, the papillary muscles, and the trabeculi. And this, the left ventricle has the thicker wall because it's more pressure. So, after the left ventricle, it goes into the aortic semilunar valve right here, into the ascending aorta, to the aortic arch, and then it comes out different ways. This one is the brachiocephalic trunk, the left common carotid artery, the left subclavian artery, and the descending aorta. And this little thing is called the ligamentum aortis, aortisum, arteriosum. arteriosum. Okay, and um, these two things right here is called the uh, coronary arteries. And the coronary arteries split into the circumflex, right here, the circumflex branch the diagonal branch and the left anterior descending branch. And this is the right coronary artery and this splits into the marginal branch and the posterior branch. And these blue things are the great cardiac veins and it goes into, well the cardiac veins, it has PMS, so posterior, middle, and small right here. And this big what thing. What are they? middle, small? cardiac veins and this big thing is the coronary sinus which then goes back into the right atrium. Okay.